Are my lips ready for this? Yes, they are. I am so excited. I didn't expect this in the mail the other day and I've been waiting to try these on. MAC came out with a new formula of lipsticks. They sent me 39 signature pigment rich shades. I already purchased a few of these and if you were in my live the other night, you know that I'm giving three lipsticks away. I already have a winner. Congratulations, Tracy. I love them. I love the texture. They're comfortable. They're pigmented and I can't wait to try them for you. Before I get started, I'm gonna take out Mare Velvet Teddy. These are the new ones. I'm gonna put them over here. And Captive Audience. Okay, Captive Audience goes to the side for Tracy. Eek! I'm excited. I'm a bit nervous for my lips, but I don't care, I'm doing this. I'm gonna try the lipsticks on without any lip liner. I got so excited I forgot to introduce myself. If you're new here, my name is Julie Meekle. I'm 52 years old. I'm a professional makeup artist, a licensed hairstylist, hoping to help you out. I'm gonna keep the intro short because I'm just too excited. I have no idea what I'm picking up first. I usually go from light to dark, but I'm not gonna do that today. I'm just, oh yeah, I picked the darkest. Okay, well. Let's just go for it. This is Diva. I love Diva. I think that this was the lipstick that Sharon Stone used to wear all the time. Diva, I'm sure it was Diva. It's very hard to put on a dark lipstick without a lip liner. I love this color so much. I'm just gonna see if I can adjust the light. Hold on. Yeah, I feel like that lighting looks a bit better. I hope. Does MAC have a Diva lip liner? All right, they have Ruby Woo, Red, and Cherry. I have Cherry, but I feel like it might be the wrong color. Yeah, it is. So I'm not gonna bother making that perfect. I feel like a Diva. So to describe the texture for you, it's movable still. Like, it doesn't feel thick. It doesn't feel uncomfortable at all. There's a bit of hydration there. It feels like it's dry enough to stay, but not so dry that it's going to make your lips crack. And there's just that little bit of shine to it, but it's not glossy. I feel like my lights might be reflecting a little bit more and making it look shinier than it is. Let me take a photo of myself in daylight and I'll show you. One down, 38 to go. I wanted to show you the packaging too. It's a little bit different than the old one. It's very pretty. Next up is Marrakesh. Oh, I like that. I wouldn't normally pick this color. It's a little bit warm for me. Normally I pick something cooler. I'm going for all the dark first. This is Russian Red. I keep taking pictures of what it looks like in natural light and I'm losing the light. I better hurry. All right, this is called taupe. Yeah, I remember taupe being one of my favorites. I love this color. Super comfortable. Definitely an everyday color. Okay, this is Lady Danger. This is gonna be bright. I am really surprised I liked that one. Who knew? I knew I liked it on other people. Okay, this is, who am I kidding? Mullet to the max. This is new, is it? I don't remember this one. More of a muted color. Look at how uneven I am. Does anyone have perfectly even lips? Probably. <laughs> wow, I feel like everybody could wear these colors. I think I've liked everything. That's unusual. This should be interesting. This one's called Lipstick Snob. I don't think this is gonna look good on me. I think some people can look so good in this. It sure is a cool color. How would I zhuzh this up a little bit? So what if I were to take Soar and just deepen this up a little bit? To me, this looks better. And I still have that tone, the lipstick snob, but it gives me more depth. This is called Twig Twist. Oh, I know I'm gonna like this. I own three original twigs. That was my favorite color. So pretty. This one is Cafe Mocha. Mm, I don't think this is gonna work. Let's see, this is Honey Love.
I kind of like this too, but I have to boost it with a lip liner, I think. I have oak lip liner. Let's try that one. Is it doing anything? Hmm. Let's wipe this off. I don't know, just start fresh. Let's try maybe strip down. It's as even as it's gonna get. Okay, let's try Honey Love again. Yeah, I think on me, it just needs that little definition on the outer edges. And the Honey Love right there, it creates dimension. Pretty, I need a new wipe. Let's put some treatment on for a minute. and Let that sit. My lips don't feel dry though. They look dry, but they don't feel dry. Ah, that feels good though. <laughs> okay, a little bit of foundation. This is kind of sexy. I like this. Seriously, look how soft and pretty that is. It's like springy. I don't wanna take this one off. I really like that one. This is called Whirl. Not too brown, not too red, not too plum. It's a perfect mix of everything. Oh, this one is gonna be crazy. Oh, I don't think that you're getting the right color on camera. The sun's going down. I hope you can see these well. <laughs> oh my God. This is, yeah, this is a hard no for me. No. Does it look horrible? A little overpowering for my face, I think. Oh, that one's staining my lips. Pfft, looks like I had a popsicle. I know I like this one. This is called Sin. I feel badass when I wear this. Am I allowed to say that? You want your teeth to look white? Wear Sin. Oh, I have forgotten where my lips are. <laughs> What kind of job is this? <laughs> oh. Hold on. <clears throat> okay, I'm getting closer to the end. Bear with me. Okay. Oh God. I've actually done pretty good up until now. <laughs> I've made such a mess. And here's the problem with darker lipstick. I love this color and I want to do it justice. So let me clean this up. It's the peaks I have a hard time with. I don't know which lip liner would match this one. I don't have one. Okay, I think that did it. Yeah. Ooh, I'm excited about this one. It's called Soar. I know I'm gonna like it. So I have a question. Are they getting rid of the original? Soar they must. I like this formula better for sure. This is not an even job. Luckily, I have sore lip liner. It's a short little stub, but it will work. Good enough. What's left? We've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight left. This is a big job. This is Forever Curious. That's pretty. What's it called again? Forever Curious. Okay, I might save this to last. This is called Caviar, I think. Yeah, definitely a new color and very dark, so I'm gonna wait for that one. That'll be the end. Please be a light color. This is Velvet Teddy. Everyday color. This is Captive Audience. Oh, 
Also one of the giveaways. I really like this one. So far, the only ones I don't like, it's just been Candy Yum Yum. I've liked everything else. Let's do chili now. I like this too. I never would have imagined. Let's go with Mare. This is Ruby Woo. I have two more left. Heroin and caviar. Quite a way to exfoliate my lips. Everybody, oh, it's called Everybody's Heroin. Wait, yeah, Everybody's Heroin. Totally outside my comfort zone. But it's a pretty color. Not really my style, but it's pretty. Actually, I kind of like it. I don't think I would wear it. I think this is soft looking. Like it's softer than Sin. Okay, let's get on with caviar. Okay. I'm supposed to go out to dinner tonight with my husband. I should go out like this. Say, okay, I'm ready. Let's give this a fair shot. My skin is about done. It's very vampy. It's outside my comfort zone. This color is for somebody for sure. It goes on really smooth. It's not patchy at all. It doesn't feel waxy. My application is awful. I don't even know how to fix that because I don't have a, a lip liner that would go. I'd have to use an eyeliner to fix it or I can use a lip brush that also, if I have a steady hand, might get a nice line. You get the idea. Like the texture of it's beautiful. I can't say anything bad about it except for it doesn't go with me. Okay, I'm gonna take this off and end off with one that I love, which is gonna be hard to choose. Oh, where was that nice light, that springy one? Kinda sexy, let's put that on. Watch me look back at it on camera and think, ooh, what was she thinking? <laughs> This suits my mood, especially after all those dark colors. So I'm gonna leave it like this. I hope this video helps you. I love the new formulation. It's not really matte. It's exactly what it says. It's a silky matte, but it's more silky than it is matte. I think you can see that on camera. We are going through it at this age when it comes to dryness and moisture. So I'm happy that the formula has changed. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Thank you so much, Mac, for sending these over. I appreciate it so much. All of the lipsticks are gonna be listed in the description box for you. I hope you like this. If you did, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, share with all your friends, and I will see you later. Bye.